uh, Colin, just, you know, another really good start for you. Uh, what, what, is, what was working for you tonight? And, uh, you know, a, a little bit of uh, some wildness last week. So how good was it to bounce back this week? Yeah, it was definitely good. So my first inning wasn't – everything kind of wasn't there. But second, third inning, I think everything felt good and just letting them hit the ball. Trust the defense behind me, so – I guess you were in the room now. And then Dave says you're going to pitch on the weekend. Is that is that like exciting for you? I mean, is it does it really matter when? I mean, what's it like being kind of a, a midweek guy that's now maybe going to be uh, thrown on the weekend in SEC? It's definitely excited. Just anything that helps the team kind of excites me. So it's pretty much it for me. So. Colin, they loaded the bases there in the third inning. Uh, I think there was a mound visit. Just so what was the key to getting out of that unscathed? It was kind of just. Having me relax, there wasn't much serious talk in the mound visit, so it pretty, that helped me a lot too. Just kind of relax my mind, get back in the zone, and try to let them hit the ball and pop it up center. So it helped. You know, you had pretty big swing. It ended up being uh, just what were you looking for in that at bat, and then what what did you see in that at bat? Yeah, um, in the past, you know, week or so, I feel like I've been just missing my pitch. Um, so I was looking for a fastball there. Um, took the first one he threw me. He brought that one in a little bit, and. Uh, Hopefully, it, or good thing it, you know, kept going through the wind. I wasn't sure if it was was going to, but uh worked out. Yeah, Colin, obviously it's still early in your career, but you've gotten some pretty valuable experience starting games, coming in in a big situation in Arlington. Just how much confidence have you built these last few weeks as a pitcher? It's definitely helped me. Um, just getting a routine and all that, building up my confidence more. So the first couple, uh, like last week wasn't the best, but just coming back this week and doing pretty well helped me a lot. Peyton, you've been, you know, swinging it pretty well, playing good defense, but not been in the lineup every day. I'm sure it's, you know, you've you've dealt with this kind of thing before, but just what's what have these last few weeks been like? You know, just trying to stay locked in and do your job even when you're not playing all the time. I mean, it's it's pretty easy to stay locked in when you like the guys, you know, that are playing, and I think that's a testament to like the team that we have, a uh, really good group of guys. Everybody likes each other, uh, and so the guys that aren't playing, you know, they're doing a good job, being good teammates, rooting for the guys in front of them, and then when they get their chance. The roles are reversed, and uh, I think it's just a testament to how good we are. It's It seems like even when Dave does kind of – when Coach Van Horn does maybe start guys back-to-back -back games, there's always changes in the lineup, too, like where guys are hitting. What's that like as a hitter right now? I mean, are you guys kind of – is he keeping you on your toes? I mean, how much conversation is there before each game about where you might be hitting in the lineup? Not, there's not a lot of conversation. It's more just like being prepared, you know, to do whatever job you have to do to help the team win, whether what, whatever situation, you know, comes up in the lineup. Uh, I don't think we look into it that deep because at the end of the day, it's you versus the pitcher. And yeah, the, the runners on base might have like a little change to the situation. But other than that, we're just staying with our approach. Yes. I was just add on to that. Yeah. Like, you know, he moves around a little bit, but I don't think anyone looks, you know, too far into it. Um, and you look at, like Lovich, you know, let off a couple games this past weekend, did a really good job, um, was seeing the ball really well. And, uh, you know, he's down there today. I don't think – that's just an example. Uh, I mean, I was hitting five today. But, uh, you know, with Stovall back too, it's another left-handed bat. So, uh, you know, it kind of helps us with, you know, with set-up guys. If they're bringing them out of the pen, uh, maybe they can only face one hitter if we can go left-right, left-right as much as we can. So, uh, yeah, no one looks too too far into it. And, you know, we trust him. So, Kenda, you've, you've been, it's been a really good season, but, you know, the the homers, just two, two in the past three games, the power starting to come. Is anything maybe shifted in approach or just, just being patient, kind of waiting for that power to kind of show up? Yeah, you know, they come, you know, home runs, I mean, they come when usually when you're not trying to hit a home run. And, uh, you know, at times, you know, in the past, I guess, you know, early this season, you know, I was just maybe trying to do a little bit too much, you know, taking a deep breath and doing this our whole life and, uh, you know, just going out there and trying to hit the ball hard on the line and good things will happen. Peyton, how do you feel over there at third base? Are you pretty comfortable there now? Yeah, I mean, we work there a lot in the offseason. It's 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 not too bad. You know, I'm comfortable over there at, at second. I mean, just wherever he, wherever he needs me to play. You know, we've talked about it. Uh, I could play third, second, left. I even almost caught last year. Um, so it's just wherever the, they need me to play, you know. And, and for Kendall and for uh, Peyton, during the fall and like the preseason with, with Gackle, he's come in and pitched in a lot of tough spots. I mean, is that something you saw from him like in the preseason? Like this is a guy who could pitch in these kind of situations. He, the first outing, we were like, yeah, this guy's gonna help us win. Uh, I mean, he, it's an uncomfortable AB for sure, especially as a righty. I mean, he hides the ball well. He's, he does a really good job locating. Uh, he's he's pretty special. Yeah, he's he's legit. I remember my first at bat. Uh, 
I, I think I fell off the heater and I was like, shoot, man, that's, I missed that one. You know, it's like, I think it was like 98, uh, there were nasty change of curveball slider, you know, he's got it all. But, uh, yeah, I think, you know, I mean, I remember walking in the door first day after summer ball, I got back here and that's all everyone was talking about was his first bullpen. Uh, this kid, I don't know how he's even here, but, uh, yeah, we're, we're super happy. He's on, on the team and he's doing an amazing job for us. All right, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.